From 1941 to 1945, Willys produced the MB model, the original Go Anywhere, Do Anything vehicle, which came to be known by its nickname, Jeep. Made famous during World War II, Willys produced over 300,000 MB vehicles. Jeeps were heavily used by every division of the American military, with 140 Jeeps provided to every infantry regiment in the U.S. Army. Large numbers of Jeeps were shipped to the Allied forces of Britain and Russia. That is nearly 30% of total Jeep production. At the end of World War II, Willys realized that it could leverage its wartime fame and enter the consumer vehicle market under an already well-known brand name. The first civilian Jeep was the CJ-2A, also known as the Universal. It offered features not found on the military MB model, including a tailgate, side-mounted spare tire, higher windshield, and larger headlights. The retail price was $1,090 and the CJ-2A was produced from 1945 to 1949. Those older Jeeps could hit the trails, just like the Jeeps of today. From 1955 to 1983, the CJ-5 was a popular model. Overlapping with the CJ-5 model was the CJ-6, which had a stretched 20-inch longer wheelbase. Moving closer to modern Jeeps, the CJ-7 was introduced in 1976 and had a very successful 10-year run. With a wheelbase 10 inches shorter than the CJ-6, this was the best handling and smoothest riding CJ ever. And it is still popular today. The first Wrangler, the YJ was launched in 1986 and ran through 1995. Although the new Wrangler stood out from its CJ predecessors by its square headlights, its body was a direct evolution of the preceding CJ7 and rode on the same wheelbase. The Wrangler featured an updated interior, offered more comfort and improved safety and handling through a revised chassis that included a wider track and a slightly lower stance. The Jeep Wrangler TJ is the second generation of the Jeep Wrangler off-road and sport utility vehicle. Introduced in 1996 as a 1997 model, the TJ reintroduced the circular headlights the classic Jeep models had been known for. For the 2004 model year, the Long Wheelbase Unlimited model was introduced. The Jeep Wrangler JK is the third generation of the Jeep Wrangler off-road vehicle. The Jeep's body and chassis were completely redesigned during the era just like the Willys MB, the CJ Jeeps and the Wranglers before it. The JK continues to have a separate body and frame, rigid live axles both front and rear, and a fold-flat windshield. In addition to the traditional two-door Jeep, the JK introduced for the first time a factory standard four-door model, called the Wrangler Unlimited. The Jeep Wrangler JL is the fourth generation of the Wrangler off-road vehicle, available in two- and four-door bodies. Unveiled in 2017, the Wrangler has retained a body on frame construction and solid axles. The vehicle is offered with three different four-wheel drive systems, Command Track, Select Track, and Rock Track. Options available on all JL models include an anti-spin rear differential. The JL is designed to be more comfortable on the road.
The JT Jeep Gladiator is a mid-size pickup truck manufactured by the Jeep division. It was introduced at the 2018 Los Angeles Auto Show on November 28, 2018, and went on sale in the spring of 2019 as a 2020 model. Based on the same platform as the Wrangler JL, the Gladiator is Jeep's first pickup truck since the Comanche was discontinued in 1992. We hope you enjoyed our look back on the evolution of Jeep. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Now go hit the trails.